So welcome back everybody. In our last episode we just took out Corinth and we took over Kydonia. And we are in a massive war with uh, Macedonia. So far we haven't faced off against the bulk of their troops. Just a rather small force that we were able to take out with our cavalry. They've got a much larger force over here towards Salona. We'll see what they do. Salona is a very small town so uh, it's generating a lot of income though so yeah losing it, it's gonna hurt but uh, hopefully we'd be able to take it back fairly soon so I'm gonna have to figure out which way to go I don't think um, I want to send a big massive force over to Salona I'd rather send my troops towards the Macedonian mainlands and try to take uh, some of their bigger cities and uh, I don't see any Macedonian fleets, so I'm not worried about them invading the Italian mainlands unless they try to march over here. Uh, interesting, it looks like uh, the Julii, who've got some massive experience over here, look at that. They are interested in Segestica. They can have it. So I'm going to go ahead and just end our turn. Okay, interesting. We're being attacked by a rebel navy, which has uh, got a little bit more quality, better quality ships. We'll see what happens. It's like 50-50 odds. And we did win. We managed to win. It's kind of costly. Alright, the Senate wants us to blockade Thessalonica. We'll try and do that, although our fleet needs to be retrained. We've got a couple of big fleets over here. I don't think I can get to my port in Corinth in time and this uh, rebel fleet is uh, awfully close. Can I build a port somewhere? I can't. Greece has betrayed us after making the peace treaty that we had last turn but I can get this army over so I will do that. Let's get them over to the mainland. And yeah, this uh, fleet's going to be real trouble. And I don't know how I'm going to get back. And I can't build. I don't. I got one turn to go for the port in Athens. I could. Where is the. I'd have a couple turns before I could build a port in Athens. Unfortunately, I can't build a port here. It's just town is too small. I'm just going to go ahead and send them out this way. Yes, Captain. And we'll try to blockade. We did not get any Senate offices assigned, which is kind of interesting. Uh, we've completed every Senate mission so far. We have the highest ranking in the Senate and with the people. Why can't we get any Senate offices. Quintus Scipio, Lucius Julius, and Juliana Scipio have offices, but we don't have any. It's probably because I don't think we have anybody with really high influence. Well, I don't know why Tiberius can't be a, an officer. Yeah, that's surprising considering how well we're doing with the uh, Senate missions. Oh well. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just fight this battle real quick. And then we'll take Sparta. Uh, the odds are um, not as good as I had hoped for. But uh, if I get my cavalry out of the city, I should be able to deal with them and flank their hoplites pretty, pretty easily. Alright, so it looks like they're lined up here against the south gate. Uh, I'm going to have my cavalry start to move out of the west gate. And I've got some more cavalry just so I don't jam up my, my gates. I've got more cavalry in the south gate. And I've got my infantry lined up here on the front gate. We'll see what they do. I don't know if they're running away or repositioning themselves. I'm going to get my infantry. I'm going to wait a little bit. 
Uh, if they're rushing my cavalry, I'm going to go ahead and start sending my guys out of the gate. If they charge me outside the gate, I got my Velites on the wall here. Uh, I'm going to see if I can get this Velite to occupy over here. Yeah, it looks like they are running to get towards my cavalry on the flanking maneuvers. Or they're just retreating in general. See how my guys are doing exiting the gates. It just takes forever for guys to get through this little bottleneck. Let's get another Velites over along the walls. I don't know if they're going to ever come close enough. Okay, it looks like they're lining up over here. Get my cavalry just double time. I get this cavalry to double time over here. And how's my infantry doing? Okay, they're almost out of the gate. Get my infantry. Let's just line them up here for for now. Get them moving out soon enough. Yeah, I don't think we're ever gonna get close enough. Let's get some velites outside. Uh, get them lined up behind my infantry. Just gonna take a long time get formed up. I think they're in full-blown retreat. But this time I will be able to reach at least some of their peasants. But I think the bulk of their army will be able to escape. <laughs> These peasants just have a horde of horsemen charging downhill at them. Let's go take some hoplites. Get over there. Oh wow. These guys turned around really quickly. And there's no way for me to flank them because they're in the corner here. And 
and I'm losing tons of cavalry because of it. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. Well, despite them getting away, we managed to get 800 kills. We lost 82 guys, mainly because of that one hoplite that was able to turn around right at the border. Victory! Let's see how far he runs away. So he goes all the way back into the city, but they do have another unit here that I can hit outside. So let's get everybody except for my peasant to attack. And see if we can take Sparta. Alright. This time it looks like it's a one to one. They've got tons of hoplites. But very little cavalry. No cavalry except for probably his bodyguard. Uh, so hopefully we'll be able to flank him with our cavalry. Because we don't have a lot of infantry. Alright, looks like the uh, enemy is lined up down there. Let's go ahead and get my infantry. Let's try to take this group out as quickly as possible. So I'm going to get my infantry and my Velites on the march. They got reinforcements right behind us. And they're on the hills. So, not good. Let's go and move out as fast as I can. Let's have these guys double time. Velites, get firing. Cavalry, get get behind them. Double time. Other cavalry, this way, go. Double time. All right, let's hit them in the back. Oh, those are Spartan hoplites. Wow. Okay. And we got the enemy general. Be praised. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. Uh oh. Get away. Get away. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Don't don't charge him front on. Head on. Don't charge him head on. Cavalry. Okay, they're fleeing. Good. This is kind of chaotic. I'm used to being able to pause <laughs> missions. I mean, pause battles. And since I can't, uh, okay, I gotta get, I gotta get back up the hill and face this group. You guys are gonna double time. Velites, form a screening force. Double time. Cavalry, forget about pursuing the enemy. We are gonna. The enemy army is in flight. Them We're gonna hit them, them the in the flanks. Double time. How about our infantry? Are they gonna make it in time? Let's go here. Right here. Double time. Get in formation. Our guys winded. Some of our velites are winded. Our infantry's okay. Let's get velites here. Uh, yeah, they don't have any cavalry, so they can't really pursue us. But we're kind of boxed in here by the corner. So I want to be careful. But we got to get flanking position. Infantry. Okay, hoplites. Form your hoplite formation. Did I save any cavalry for my left flank? I, I didn't. Let's get them involved. No. Okay. All right. We got their general charging us. We're going to send all of our cavalry over. Let's get this group over here. We should be able to take out their enemy general pretty quickly. And let's get this Histadi forward. 
And we'll hit them. We'll hit this hoplites with our cavalry. Enemy general's dead. Nice. Don't want to take any hoplites dead on. Head on. Okay, we got this hoplites to retreat. Infantry, form up. Cavalry, form up. And what do we got over here? Their peltists are pelting us. Hit them with our velites. I need to get a cavalry over there to help out with their peltists. Let's do two, three. And get the infantry. Line up. Cavalry. No. No, 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 no. Cancel that. Their backs are turned, but they can flip around in an instant. Get these guys back. So, infantry. I want my throw javelins. Okay, looks like they are going after this group. We got those peltists to run. Let's get these hoplites. Alright, get these hoplites. Let's get these hoplites to flee. Charge! Alright. It's looking good. Let's start pursuing the fleeing troops. They should be on a full on route any second. Am I missing anything? No. Why aren't they routed yet? Okay, there we go. We're gonna. We are gonna pursue them. And try to take Sparta without a fight. All right. A nice victory. About a little over 300 killed, and we killed over 1,700. Really good victory. I'm very happy with this. It was kind of chaotic, and without being able to pause, I was, uh, I did pretty good, I think. They did get one army to be able to return to Sparta, so that is unfortunate. I wonder if I'm going to, nope, I'm not going to have to worry about this town, so... I can go ahead and just take Sparta just like this and they only have one hoplites one peltist so we're gonna go ahead and take Sparta all right I'm gonna try to surround them on three sides get this first group going Get this group going. Okay, they do have some hoplites. Maybe I can hit them real quick. Let's get these guys all just to charge these hoplites before they get into the city. And get these guys going as well. Let's just head towards the town square. All right. They are hoplites, so I need to be careful. Back off. Double time. Don't engage. Don't engage. Come on. I don't want to head on fight with hoplites. Let's hit them with our velites. We can hit them with another group of hoplites, I think. Hoplites are really good for city defense. Let's get my general to try to sneak up on him, hit him in the back. Oh, I don't want to... Okay, yeah, yeah, let's just get him with our Triarii. Let's get our general to hit him. Because we can't get him from... They're no longer in hoplite position. They can't maintain it. we got him surrounded. That'll work. Send our elite Triarii after them. But we're losing a lot, unfortunately. Man, these guys have a lot of uh, morale. And uh, I'm just going to send everybody after this group. This, th 
these uh, hoplites should, should be wavering. Let's just go. They're just peltists. So we should be able to take them. And these hoplites should be... There's only four left. Alright. And... Got their general. Thank God be praised. The enemy general is killed. So Fear everyone should just charge. We don't even need missiles. I'm gonna try to get this general to get him from behind. If he'll listen, seems like he doesn't want to listen. Just go where I say to go. Maybe if I go over here. I mean, you got this big giant square. It doesn't seem like there's any pathfinding issues. Right? You got a big giant square, but yet they're just dancing around. I don't understand why. I can understand having troubles with pathfinding in narrow streets. But when you got a big town square, and I say, go over here, why do they just get caught in those buildings. I don't know. But, we got him, and I don't think we lost too many guys. We lost probably like 40 Triarii, which kind of sucks, because I can't retrain them. Uh, yeah, 40 guy, 46 guys, and 40 Triarii. I charge those hoplites front on. Probably not the smartest idea with Triarii. But, we won. Um, you know, those Triarii weren't going to last forever. We're going to go ahead and enslave this population. You know, we had our spy in here this whole time. I didn't even realize it. Let's have him spy on this army. Just to get him some experience. Okay. They've got their light lancers. Really weak hoplites. With these levy pikemen. And militia hoplites are pretty weak. But these phalanx pikemen are pretty decent hoplites. So, but it's just one unit. They got 240 guys in there, though. These also have 240 guys. So this is a little bit more formidable army than what we're used to seeing. Actually, all my horsemen over to Corinth. And they'll get retrained in Corinth. That way I can get back up to full strength instantly. And then I can retrain these guys here. I can get a peasant here. And then I'll be able to march out next turn. Uh, we'll get Galerius. Galerius just to sit in Corinth. Actually, is he even going to make any difference? Yeah, I think he will. Let's see if he'll make any difference in income. No difference in income. But that's okay. We'll go back to very high tax rate. Since we're in a war with Macedonia. And... Oh, wow, we can get archers. I want to get archers. So we can get the governor's villa in Apollonia. We'll do that. Get the governor's palace in Tarentum. I'm gonna get this army marching down into towards the the battle here. Get these guys marching forward as well. We'll raise the tax rate in Apollonia now that it's grown. And also in Athens. Crete. Uh, we'll go ahead and get farms and a peasant. So we can raise the taxes here. We'd love to get these guys off this island. I'm going to get my horsemen into Athens. All right, I'm going to go ahead and end my turn, see what Macedonia does. Okay, we are under attack by that rebel navy. And we lost. 
And I think Croton, I definitely want to get the Governor's Palace over here. Yes. Let's master. get our spy into Larissa. But what do I do with uh, Corinth and Sparta? Well, let's see how much of my army I can move out. Sir, let's leave Avalites and see if I, if that'll be enough. March. It's not. Let's Order. give him another Valates. That should be good. I will train a peasant here. And in Corinth, let's see. Orders. Move out. All right, Corinth, I want to move out. Orders. I'm gonna leave my my g governor here. Let's move out. One thing I'm really lacking is infantry. Ooh, Cretan archers and hoplites. Let's get them. So I should be able to, this army is going to be pretty decent. I can send one set of peasants over here and get my Velites to move out. But we can't meet up just yet. We can move them into Athens. No, I can't. I want to get these guys in Sparta and uh, retrain them. We'll get farms in Athens. Train up more fleets. I'm gonna move this army out and get these guys to merge up so that they can help out in the fight. Thurman's got a lot of people. I wonder if I can move the uh, my faction heir to head up this Order. army. Yeah, because we have enough. I can build a trader here. It's about all the money I have left. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and uh, try to attack this group. We're not close enough. That's fine. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end my turn. We've got a lot of Macedonian armies nearby. Yeah, I expected that. We lost. Oh, good. He's retreating. Oh no, he's getting attacked again. Okay, we lost our admiral. Oh, look at that. Interesting. Very interesting. He's stepped onto our land. We've got the Julii over here. The rebels seem to have disappeared. I wonder if he fought the rebels. We're just going to give him Salona if he goes after us. We're going to take Larissa. Ooh, Captain Philip over here has got me concerned. We got another general. Where's he at? He's in Athens. Cool. So he's a political an animal. He's not good at management, but he's good at command. A natural born commander. Cool. We'll have to do something with him. Uh, this army he's got a lot of hoplites. Heavy cav. No commander. We'll have to deal with him. And then come over and help with this army? Or do I want to take this army General. first so I can merge my units? Order. Yeah, let's do that. Let's move our faction heir out. Forward. Aulus. And uh, we'll send Amulius over this way. And we'll have him surrounded. They cannot flee from battle. If it loses, all units will be destroyed. We'll let the AI control our faction heir. Alright. All right, they kind of got the hills over here. We're going to try to hit them from the side. Let's get our infantry moving out. Our archers moving out. Unfortunately, I wish they didn't have such good high ground. But let's get our cavalry like this. Looks like our reinforcements are actually closer. Let's get all our guys to double time for a little bit. 
I don't want our faction air to get killed in this battle if he rushes in too fast. So I don't want to get my guys tired though. Let's do my cavalry to just walk. I don't want them to get too far ahead. Let's actually get this group over here. Alright, I think everybody's going to walk. my archers like this I mean my infantry like this archers move up I don't want to make the mistake do I have any more cavalry yeah cavalry I want to make sure my cavalry is on both flanks this time instead of just one time Let's get my missiles to just charge up and maybe attack this hoplites on their left flank. Maybe I send a couple of cavalry here. Actually, let's go after this guy. Let's charge their light lancers. If we can catch him. So... Archer, Velite's doing a good job. Let's hit this group. Archer's doing a good job. Infantry's marching up. Okay, we got that light lancer. Let's get this heavy cav. Take care of them. What's my general doing? He's just sitting back. And what about this cavalry? Let's go ahead and hit... I'm gonna hit this hoplite. We're gonna get our infantry, our cavalry back. They're two separate. Is that my cavalry charging head-on into hoplites? Yes, it is. I was worried about the AI doing that. Uh, what do you know? I did it. But they're fleeing. It is kind of crazy. I'm just so used to pausing battles. Okay. Looks like we are got things kind of under control. Gotta watch out for my general. These guys are hoplites. Like, one thing I'm worried about is <laughs> if this army flees again, are they gonna just teleport across the map like they did last time? Because the last time that happened with that Greek, with the Greek uh, faction error, they actually were in the same situation where he couldn't run. He wasn't supposed to be able to run, but he did, and they teleported all the way from like Thurman to Sparta. It was crazy. Okay, we're getting them in the rear and they are routed. I think they just got one group left. So one of the things in this battle is I don't want to take a lot of casualties because there's so many Macedonian armies. If I take heavy casualties I'll be outnumbered in the future. But I think we're doing pretty good. We did have that one cavalry charge onto straight up hoplites, but I think we routed them pretty quickly. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them. Yeah, we're going to pursue them. The Even though they're not supposed to be able to flee, it'll still give us our guys experience. Nice. Uh, we lo did lose 172 guys. I'm guessing most of that's going to be our equites. Yep. From our units, not our reinforcements. Oh, they did lose quite a bit of hostility. They lost 49 hostility. Victory! 
And we did route that unit. So I am going to merge this group. And we didn't lose anybody. But this cavalry. Let's get him into Thurman. And retrain him. He'll probably lose all his experience though. But it looks like now I cannot reach, go back here and reach Larissa. So I'm going to send a couple of Hastati in to this army. And I'm going to get Aulis to just sit back into Thurman. And maybe take on this army. Um, I definitely need a little bit more Hastati. I've got... These guys, um, these equites, I should probably just send with Omulus. We're going to send him up here on the hills and uh, get this group. Now he's full and we'll get these two guys um, we'll sit in Athens just for now and you will sit in Athens so we'll get Athens we'll retrain those Hastati build get another Hastati man Athens is so tiny right now because of all the training I'm doing um, Corinth is pretty big I need to get Hastati going in more cities. Let's get another Hastati over here. I've got pretty good cavalry, pretty good missile troops. I just need a little bit more infantry, I think. We'll get the wooden walls in Apollonia. I am slowly building up a fleet over here. I will not be able to complete this mission because the pirates took me out. And I still got this army stuck here. We'll go. I'm going to go and have him build a watchtower. We can keep an eye on the pirates a little bit. Uh, we'll go ahead and get a wooden palisade in Kydonia. All right, I'm going to go ahead and end my turn. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take Larissa or besiege it. Oh, looks like their gates are open. This is going to be kind of a tough siege for me because they've got a lot of phalanx pikemen. Um but we we can uh, we got our we got some archers to weaken them and let's go. Before night comes again, this battle will be over. Whether the day goes well or ill is in our hands. The gods will favor those who help themselves. So take up your arms and prepare. Those overconfident men are the army of Macedon. They think themselves as good as us, but I think they are awaiting the funeral pyre. On this field stand one in four of our people's warriors. We are enough then to win great honor and do great service. This and more, I have no doubts that you will do. They think their walls are enough to stop us. They should think again. We outnumber them comfortably, but that should not be seen as an excuse not to fight hard. Why let your brother carry your burden? Until the enemy walls crumble, our brave horsemen can do little. Let us breach those walls and hunt down the enemy. Some of us will soon lie dead. The rest will drink to their memory, but as always, we Romans will fight with honor! Alright, we're going to fight them from three different sides. I'm going to send my archers out first. Unit, hurry, hurry. 
and try to take this first gate. We'll just leave our guys out right for now. Uh, see if they march out after us. Definitely not going to try to take those guys. But I may have some Velites up front to just launch some missiles at them. Same with this group over here. We'll just get our Velites. Actually, I think I'll just go ahead and send them to attack. They should not go in the gates. That would be my biggest concern. Alright, let's make sure that our infantry is supporting our archers here. Get them on the move. We've got our cavalry. We won't do much yet. I'm going to keep an eye on my Velites. Halt. Don't want to go in the gates, for sure. Just throw spears at them. That's all I want you to do. Uh, are they not in range? Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's a Peltis battle. Well, you know what? If it's, that's all they got over here, let's go ahead and charge them. Let's take this gate. There's nothing else over here. Interesting. Take a look at my main gate. And just make sure my archers are not running after them. Great gods! Our soldiers have done well this day. The walls are taken! Just to have them shoot their missiles. Okay, let's get this infantry in the gates now that they're clear. And we're taking on their Peltists. We should win. Let's see if they get reinforcements. Let's get this cavalry a little bit closer. Have these guys double time. Form up like this. Double time. Okay, this cavalry is pursuing a little bit too far. Let's have them go out. We've got more Peltists. We've got their light lancers. Actually, let's let's take them. <laughs> what are these guys doing? Get them in here too. And get this cavalry in here. Okay, what do we got here? We've got their pikemen. Get these guys up closer. Get these guys up closer. Double time. What do we got over here? We're fighting their light lancers. Let's get these guys in here. Yeah, I have no idea what I'm doing in this battle. It's just hectic is all get out. Yeah, I'm not I'm not going to go in here just yet. These guys are doing the bulk of the fighting. Okay, we got that cavalry to rout. Or those peltists. Uh, I don't know where they're who else is fighting? Okay, what do we got here? Phalanx. Oh, shoot. Um, let's get my infantry over here. Can I... Okay, good. They're routed. Nice. Halt. Get in Phalanx formation. Just stand there. Triari, I back them up. Alright. Got to keep tabs on everybody. It's so hard without being able to pause. Um, can I get these guys to go this way? Double time. Maybe they'll pursue. Okay, they're running away. Let's get them. Or is that a fake runaway? 
send this group this way. What do we got? Okay, get our Velites in here. Just cavalry on this side. What's our general doing? Make sure he's okay. All right, archers. Oh wow, they're taking on our hoplites with cavalry charge. We can support them with triarii. And that should go well. What's going on here? Okay, not ideal. Not ideal. I'll probably rush this attack, but they'll route soon. We got him surrounded. Alright. We're routing. They're routing. Can I rally from over here? I don't know. Don't you see the enemy routing? Don't route when the enemy's routing. Okay. Nice. We got him. Triarii, back up. Alright, can we get this? Can we march out? Not yet. I don't want to go yet. But maybe Valates. What do we got here? Light Lancers? That was, that's kind of done with them. What's this Valates doing? Let's just get this group marching towards the town center. And we got this unit just spread out everywhere. Let's get this group moving up. Triarii backing them up. Can I form up like this? Triarii behind them. Let's go ahead and attack that group. Nice, took him out pretty quickly. What else we got going on? Just mostly cavalry. We got... Let's get these guys to charge. That's their general. Actually a smart move on their part. Send their general out after our Velites. Okay. Just get you guys marching out. I guess don't charge. Just, just, just walk. Get this group formed up like this. Triarii. Can I get them to go after their general? I'm just gonna have these guys all charge. Can I get my Triarii to just do a sneak attack? Oh boy, oh boy, halt, halt, halt. Form up like this. Triarii doing the sneak attack on their general. Smart move. But, let's see if we can get past them. Okay, we need backup here. Backup. This just massive cluster of guys. You just need to charge this uh, hoplites. They're so huge. And that's their phalanx. Can I take out their general? Who's that? Is that my Velites? Okay, it's just my Velites. We got our Triarii coming. Okay, where's my general? Make sure he doesn't. Let's get him out of there. Oh, this is just a death suicide attack. Ah, yuck. Got their general. Can we get around this phalanx? And we got 
Equites routing. Okay, we finally routed. Do we have that? They are just ah, such a mess. Such a mess. This phalanx is just, just wrecking havoc on us. And they're still not. We've killed over half of them. Taking a Greek city is really tough because of the phalanx. When they have decent hoplites, you know, and not just the weak militia hoplites and they defend city walls. It is insane. Okay, I want to stop my missile guys from firing. I don't want to... I don't want friendly fire. We got them surrounded. Man, we took really heavy casualties in this battle. What's... Oh, those are Velites. Okay, we finally got them to route. Just a couple guys left. Killed. Almost all of them. Just this guy and one Peltis left. What's he gonna do with that spear? Ah, he got it. He threw it. Get him, he's the last guy. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drop Rome demands victory from her generals. And this day is clearly our victory. So we won. We lost 876 guys, mostly from one phalanx that was able to defend a city street, and we just we had our cavalry just charge him. There wasn't really much I could do about it. I could have had maybe my cavalry take a different route through the city and been a little bit more patient. I could have dealt with that a little better, I think. But um, it's not too bad. We, we killed twice as many as we, we lost. Victory! Okay, we are going to... I don't know if we want to exterminate... I'm thinking of exterminating this population rather than enslaving them. Because we've had a lot of growth in our cities. I'm gonna... No, I'm just gonna... Ins I need money, so... Yeah, I'm exterminating the population. Because we really need money. We gotta start tearing down their shrines to get our Roman shrines in the cities. But we managed to take Larissa. I'm going to go ahead and take a look at the faction rankings. Let's take a look at the top factions. We are rising. It looks like Gaul is still up there. Carthage is up there. Egypt is up there. And Britain. It looks like our friends, the Scipii and the Julii, and us are about the same but if you take us all combined we would be the best faction I'm sure um, how is uh, the Macedonians doing they're dropping down because we're taking the cities and I imagine Greece has gone way down too yeah so we are doing good relative to our enemies and let's take a look at military we're still pretty low, even though we've had some really big victories. Production. We've jumped up quite a bit. Egypt is still number one in production. Territories. We're number two. So we've moved up quite a bit. And finances. We are super poor. The Julii have a lot of money. Maybe they could give us some money. Help us out. And, um, oh wow, Carthage, and who is the Seleucid Empire? Also have a lot of money. And population. We've been 
enslaving a lot of people, but and training a lot of units, and they've been dying a lot. So, but we're doing pretty good. Carthage and Egypt are number ones in population. Macedonia's got a few people. Greek has dropped down significantly since we've been attacking them. Alright, and with that, I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in it here. Thank you for watching. Bye.